So zinc's important for a couple reasons. One, it's key in defense mechanisms. It has a lot of processes that deal with that. Also key in the uh, germination process in the young plant's life, helping fight diseases and all that stuff. The other reason it's important, there's a relationship to phosphorus and zinc in the plant. So we always want to keep it in a 10 to 1 phosphorus to zinc relationship. And once that gets out of balance, you can get some issues rise in the plant. If you got too much one, too much the other. You know, on Kelly's farm here, he's got high phosphorus because of our his nutrient management practices. So we're always adding zinc here to keep that balance and intact i guess would be the best way to put it and it's not easy sometimes you know we apply some zinc to the soil there's some instances where the soil has got enough zinc it's just tied up in various ways and it's not getting the plant so we still have to either put it with a planter or spray it on so we're always adding it and it's vital in those key time frames you know keeping that defense mechanism structure going in the plant We're actually harvesting a corn plot today that we did a zinc trial on. Zinc is actually a candy for the microbial activity in the soils. And the more microbial activity you have, the more root mass you get. Uh, it's just a better living environment for your roots and your plants thrive. So we put a, a cord of a product down that we're doing some research for in furrow. You gotta make sure it's safe and it's not gonna hurt your seed. We're harvesting that trial today. Early on the root mass, it was amazing when we did the root digs of the quickness of the size difference in the roots. Planted the same day, just, just adding the zinc to it, had a lot larger mass of root. Now we get to see the yield results of that trial. And we just went through a strip of it there a while ago, and that's the first time that I've seen over 200 bushels in this field. I played college football and it was vitamin C and zinc, you know, because the head coach's wife was a nurse. So that's what, you know, we got in the fall, usually flu season or whatever, to try to stay healthy. Eat all the vitamin C you can, drink your water and, and make sure you got enough zinc because it's the same process in humans as it is in plant. It's a defense mechanism, keeps your immune system strong. So it, it relates right back to the plants and, you know, they need zinc to be have a strong immune system and have strong defense against diseases, pests, all the things they battle during the growing season. You know, I wouldn't equate disease showing up as a zinc deficiency. There could be other reasons for that, but I would say that if you don't have enough zinc, that's probably another reason why you have disease. You know, I've seen where zinc is high in a plant, but it's got some disease, but on the other side of it, it's got other issues. So all things square and your zinc's deficient. Yeah, I mean, I'd be concerned about disease pressure and all that stuff.